Hello guys, how is it going? It is Faker over there, another Legends of Runeterra video. Today I'm going to be playing some Leona and Aurelian Soul, a very greedy take on the Demacia and Targon package that utilizes Lux throughout the mid game to stall out or sometimes act as an alternative win condition. Our opponent playing none other than Karma Ezreal. I knew as soon as I saw this matchup starting, I'm like, this is going to be a long game. There is probably going to be a lot of key decision making points and a really good highlight for Lux and this deck's potential and how it acts and probably showcasing everything that you would hopefully need to know about the list. Uh, link to the deck code is in the description. Also a link to my Twitch channel. I am streaming Monday, Tuesday, Friday and Saturday at 3.30 p.m. AEDD time zone. You guys have a fantastic day. I'll see you next time. So this one's going to be kind of interesting. I feel like this is going to be the matchup where I don't I don't actually know how we're going to win this. I could do something crazy like hunt for multiple reductions on a really soul. I think I just need to find like all my mid-range stuff. <laughs> I'm actually not entirely sure about this matchup. I'm kind of excited. What does a Karma Israel look like at the moment? I fight with my spirit, not my fist. Okay, so I run two times Hush in my deck. Somehow that's going to have to do something for me. Yes, sir. <laughs> Hi, McDonald's. What's up, homie? Yeah, guys, I'm not I'm not entirely sure what I'm gonna have to do in this matchup to win. <laughs> uh, but if he's willing to drop his win conditions on me, I'm more than happy to just sunburst it. I guess this is one way I could play the matchup. I just don't play anything. Long time no chat. <laughs> Gee, you guys haven't bumped into each other? Come on, bro. We found one of the hushes. This is going to be key in this matchup. I guess I could just keep passing, right? If my opponent can't like flip. <laughs> Let's just keep passing. I don't know. I think this is the way we have to play it. I'll just keep removing my opponent's stuff. Okay, I guess I'll play something now. I don't really want to find units. I just want to five find removal. He's going to do everything he can to farm this. <laughs> okay. I guess I'll just pass here for now. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All okay, right, this is a bit of a problem. <laughs> We've got too many cards in hand. My opponent has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. He has no reason to play anything, so uh I guess I can discard my uh pale cascade. He's just gonna use this as farming material. Is there a card I can play in my hand that uh maybe I just pass here? No, I can't be discarding cards. That's kind of troll. Would silencing help me at all? Silence a follower. They don't run many followers, so probably just Crescent Strike. Um, we could do this. I can do this. My opponent will clear this now. If he wants to use a mystic shot, that's fine. Gotcha, fair enough. That's a better use of his uh, resources. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, we're cool. End of round. Ah, this is so awkward. I don't know what to do. 
I have 11 mana. Star shaping doesn't allow me to play anything. I guess I'll just drop the Crescent Strike. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I'm happy to burn a card here, I guess. Uh, if I play anything, I'm allowing him to level up his Ezreal. Fuck it, let's burn a card. That's fine. Cool, that's one deny out the way. It is time. Obliterated? I sure am. I have no way to really activate Supernova now. What's he doing here? Just hitting that into my face. Sure. All right, two Ezreal's down. What is gained when we return malevolence? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I guess I could just play Aurelian Soul. So how does he clear this? He can thermo beam it, and. We can't Thermo Beam it without having a way to proc it first. Will plus something else puts it back into my hand, which I'm okay with it going back into my hand. Is there a one mana spell he can... No, he can't clear it. Um... I guess I'll take more Cosmic Rays. If I swing and he damages it, it will allow him to Thermo Beam it, not this turn. So perhaps I just don't swing. The swing doesn't actually get me anything. I'm happy to keep burning cards. <laughs> this is so stupid. <sighs> Alright, do I go for a power play this turn? I think this is when I go in, right? You know, actually having double concerted strike up this turn would have been pretty helpful. Because he could thermo beam it for 11. Actually having another spell shield card would have been amazing here. A single combat would have actually, uh, a single combat wouldn't have worked here actually. No. I'll pass for now. 
He's gonna thermo beam it for like 500 damage. There's no way he skips a turn here. Wow. Actually, I need to play something in case he wills it. He's only got one Ezreal left in his deck, which is hilarious. Perhaps I'm just fine with clearing his board. What can you do with three mana? Not a lot. He can develop Ezreal. That's super risky though for him to do. I can hush the Ezreal this turn. My spirit is can I clear the karma here? We'll bring peace to I actually can. How does he stop this? He just doesn't, right? He just can't stop this. <laughs> He can clear the 3 2, but that's not really effectively doing a lot. He's trying to find opportunities to slip in his uh, karma and stuff, but it doesn't seem to be working out for him. Now, if I open attack him, I'm putting him down to 7, which is really dramatic. So if I play a soul, he can play Karma plus Ezreal. So I can't really just allow that to happen. If I play the Charger, I can always hush him next turn if he develops fully. I would prefer to be able to flip my uh, Aurelian soul though when I play him. So perhaps I can like kind of do something a little bit in the middle. I think if I play Remembrance, that can actually threaten him to enough, but like without, yeah, I don't hate it. If I play Remembrance, so I can't Concerted Strike. I'm gonna play the Charger. How's the deck feeling? It's feeling solid, man. I, I, I think the Marcia and Aurelian Soul seems like really insane just in general. Cool. So I guess I'll play a five mana remembrance now. Or I could even play Radiant Guardian. It's probably just remembrance, right?
fades away. Like, does he want to deny this? That's fine if he wants to. Okay, so does he want to play? I'm, I'm, I'm down with this. Let's kill him. Feels unfortunate, buddy. So he wants to kill me at burst speed. I have to hush now. Otherwise, I'll find myself in a bit of trouble. This is his final Ezreal. All I have to do is hush it. And I'm in a really good spot. Let's double hush it, just to fucking threaten the final spark. He almost can't stop this. He almost cannot stop this. That doesn't change anything. Is he running retreat? <laughs> wow, he has no more Ezreal's left. That's a little insane. Wow. I honestly didn't know how this matchup was going to turn out. I don't even need to play a really soul. I can just keep doing mid range things. Holy shit. That's another karma about to go down. I'm, I'm happy just to day break it here, right? So this might be going on YouTube. Yeah, this is a solid performance. I honestly feel like I played this incredibly well. I also feel like my opponent may have um, overcommitted to playing his Ezreals, but, but maybe this is a good matchup for us. I don't know, guys. I guess I'll just end the round here, right? There's still like the um the ability for him to play karma and do some other wacky stuff. Is playing a million soul just too much of an overcommitment? I think it might be. I think I might just be better off discarding one Emerillion Soul here. And just kind of looking for some more pressure. I could even just draw some cards, honestly. I think that would be just fine. Just draw more answers. Wow, I got the extra Lux here. That's incredible. In oh my goodness, man. Uh, I guess I can just play Remembrance here now. Pretty safely. So I want to draw cards first in case there's another way to do this. I don't see any harm in it. Wow. <laughs> that hush was actually incredible in this position. Alright. 
This is probably the best game of my career. Oh, let's go. Fuck. Oh, some of these games so poor, man, takes a lot out of me.